Katie Yarborough woke up on a warm, clear June day in 1985 and prepared for her 12th cancer treatment. The 61-year-old manicurist got dressed and drove herself to the Kennestone Regional Oncology Center in Marietta, Georgia, where a state-of-the-art linear accelerator called the Therac-25 would direct high-energy electrons and or x-rays into her lymph nodes, as it had done for patients in the area thousands of times before. The Therac would need only a few seconds to painlessly deliver around 200 rads to her upper left chest, but that day, something went wrong. Yarborough felt a red-hot sensation instead of nothing. You burned me, she told the technician, who quickly assured her that this wasn't possible. Over the next few weeks, she would need one breast fully removed, and her left arm would become completely paralyzed. Kitty Yarborough was the first victim of what would be later called some of the worst software-caused accidents in history. This is the true story of the Therac-25.